The Air Design hood scoop that we have here today will be a somewhat affordable way for 2019 and newer Silverado owners to add some aggressive styling and more muscle to the factory hood, but without having to do any permanent modification and without having to break the bank. Now the Air Design will feature a two-piece lightweight molded ABS plastic construction, along with your satin black finish or matte black finish, all for right around that high $300 price point. Now the install guy is gonna be a very simple peel and stick job, so therefore figure soft one out of three wrenches on the old difficulty meter here, maybe 30 minutes of your time to complete from start to finish, but hang with me for a bit and we'll show you how it's done later in the video. Now when you're looking to change up the front end of your rig, more specifically the hood area, you'll typically find a few different ways to go about doing so. Now the most obvious that comes to mind is switching out that factory hood for something different, maybe a cowl hood or something like that, but let's face it guys, that method can be rather expensive and you typically have to have those things color matched to your truck which ultimately adds to the final price tag. Now on the other hand, or the other side of that coin, you have vinyl, which is certainly something that's gonna be far more affordable than completely switching out your hood, but the final or end results can be a bit limited. And then you have something like this, and that is to add a hood scoop such as this option from Air Design. Now the scoops are almost always going to be far more affordable than swapping out the hood altogether. And the best part is guys, it can be done easily and without any permanent modification. But enough about all that, what do you say we break down the hood scoop that is on the table with us here today? And again, it is coming to us from the gang over at Air Design. It is a two-piece design, as you guys can see right there. And it is going to fill out the low spot or the void, if you will, on that factory hood perfectly. Now, because it is a two-piece design, I've seen owners get very creative and maybe paint match the lower portion while leaving this top portion black a little bit of contrast there. I've seen owners add some badging to this portion of the scoop, and I've even seen this thing in carbon fiber as well. So as always, guys, feel free to not only read up on those customer reviews, but more importantly, check out those customer submitted images, man, because it's a better sense or a better way to get an idea of what this thing might look like when it's on your Silverado at home. Now materials again, guys, will be that durable ABS plastic we mentioned earlier, which does take its shape thanks to the injection molding process. Now Air Design states the scoop was designed using OEM CAD data, and that is to help ensure a perfect fit on the hood of the factory 2019 in newer Silverado. And that was certainly our experience here with our shop truck at AT. Last but not least, guys, the scoop has been completed, at least in this portion, in a kind of black satin or almost matte finish here, should offer nice contrast on just about any color truck out there but again you do have some other options on the site including a gloss option and there is even a primed option as well which is ready to be color matched to your rig uh, so again be sure to check out all of your options before pulling the trigger last but not least here guys i do also want to mention that the scoop is backed by a three-year or 30,000 mile limited warranty just in case you run into any issues but one of the best parts about a scoop like this is, again, it's a peel and stick job. There's no need for any cutting, there's no drilling, no molding, no permanent modification needed. Now because of that, site's just gonna go soft one out of three wrenches on the old difficulty meter here, guys. Maybe 30 minutes, a little bit more, depending on how fast you like to work uh, from start to finish. But now to give you a better idea of just how things will go down at home, feel free to check out our detailed walkthrough and tool breakdown. The tools you're gonna need for this installation include alcohol rub, a clean cloth, tape, a box cutter, the included adhesive promotion, the included polyurethane adhesive, as well as a caulk gun. How's it going everybody? Today I have a hood scoop from Air Designs that I'm going to show you how to install on this 19 Silverado. So let's get started. So our hood scoop comes in two pieces out of the box, so we're going to have to install this piece of the hood scoop onto this piece before we can put it on our truck. To do that, we're gonna need alcohol and a, some kind of cloth to wipe it down with. It also comes with an adhesion wipe that comes with the kit. And we're gonna need some tape or some, just something to mark this with so we can position this properly. And I'm gonna be using a box cutter because I will be using tape to mark it. All right, so like I said, we're gonna be installing the hood scoop insert onto the hood scoop. First thing we need to do is clean the area where, where it's gonna be mounted, which is right along this groove here. So, spray it down with alcohol. And just make sure that you get all the grease or just oil or anything 
that might have transferred from your hands onto the hood scoop. Just make sure you get that off and get it nice and clean. First step is to pre-install the insert onto the hood scoop. And you just want to make sure that you have it lined up nice and square. Once you have it where you want it positioned, grab your tape or your marker and just mark it in three places so that it, when it's ready in, to install, you can put it back. I pre-cut my tape with my box cutter. I'm just gonna go ahead and mark it. Once you have it marked appropriately, take the insert back off, get the supplied adhesion promoter, and in the same places where you cleaned it with, with the alcohol, you're gonna use this. You do want to um, wipe on these areas as well because the double-sided tape will be sticking to these sections of the hood scoop. So here, here, and in along this groove. Moving back to our hood scoop insert, we're gonna go to the under underside of it here with the double-sided tape. And now that we have the adhesion promoter down on the hood scoop itself. We're gonna start peeling the tape and get ready to mount it. So the protective film is a little tricky to get off. That's why I'm using my box cutter just to start it. And we're gonna take off all four of these protective films. Now we're gonna mount our insert onto our hood scoop. So make sure you don't put it down before you have it lined up with your markings. Once you have it in the position you want it, there you go. Now you can press and hold just for like 15 seconds or so along each edge to make sure that it does mount securely. We're almost ready to mount this onto our hood. Now's a good time to clean up your markings. So if you used a grease marker or something like that, you can use uh, either a car wash or the alcohol that you have to clean that up. Another reason I use tape is because it's just easier to clean up. Now let's prep the hood for installation. So you're gonna grab your alcohol and wipe it down. Now this is assuming that your hood is already clean like ours is. We're using alcohol just, like I said as before, just to get the rest of the residue off. What, whatever might be on your hands, you wanna get that off of the hood so that it adheres properly. Okay, now we're gonna pre-install our hood scoop onto our hood. There's a little cutout in front of the hood scoop here that you can line up with the body line in the hood. So that's center, this way. And you wanna push it all the way to the back of the hood and make sure that these creases line up with these body lines on either side as well. All right, so the lines in the hood scoop are now flush and flowing nicely with the lines in the hood. So at this point, we can mark it in place and prep the hood scoop for mounting. Now you can grab your grease marker or your tape and we're gonna mark in various locations so that when we put the hood scoop back on, it's nice and centered. It's 
So for this step, the more markings you place, the more accurately you'll be able to center it when the scoop is being mounted permanently. And I'm making sure to mark the most important areas, which in my opinion, besides this marking here that you have that lines up with the body line in the hood, will be this area here because there is a little arc and you want that to be nice and flush so there's no gaps. We have our hood scoop off the truck again, back in the work area. A Little bit of prep we have to do before we permanently mount it. So if you look along the tape, the tape here, there's an inner groove that's in rubber and we're gonna to wanna to clean this up using our alcohol and we're gonna eventually place adhesion that comes with the kit in here to permanently mount it. So let's clean that up first. So I just sprayed it down with the alcohol that we had, making sure it's nice and clean. Now that that's done, we're gonna to wanna to peel the protective film off of the double-sided tape just halfway. We're not peeling it uh, the entire way yet, just to help us line it up with our markings. The kit comes with a polyurethane adhesive. For the purposes of this demonstration, we won't be using it, but I'm gonna show you where you need to place it so you can mount this solidly onto the hood of your truck. You're gonna need a caulk gun. Once you get this open, you're just gonna place a thin bead all along here, and you can see the grooves that you're gonna follow. And there's gaps, so you don't have to put it in there. Just make sure it's going into the grooves with a thin bead, and then we'll be ready to mount it to the hood. With all the protective film peeled halfway, you're gonna wanna grab some masking tape, which you could also use for marking the hood. But in this instance, we're using it just to tape the film onto the front side or the top side of the hood scoop so that when we do mount it on the hood, we can grab it and peel it the rest of the way off. Now we can place our hood scoop back onto our hood and line it up with our markings. With the protective film peeled and the polyurethane adhesion or the silicone adhesion on the other side, you're gonna wanna be pretty careful. So just make sure that you get it relatively close when you do set it down for the first time. Let's check all our markings. Now that everything is lined up, we can go ahead and pull the film the rest of the way off. Now that we have all the protective film removed and it's in a good position back to where we had marked it, everything's nice and lined up, we can go ahead and press down firmly along all the edges Hold it for about 15 seconds in each spot so that it is mounted securely. Once that's done, you can go ahead and clean up. I'm just gonna remove my tape. If you use marker at home, just grab some soapy water or your alcohol and give it a good wipe down. That's gonna wrap up this review and install of the Air Design Hood Scoop in Satin Black for the 19 and newer Silverado and Sierra. 
Thanks for watching, and for all things Silverado and Sierra, keep it right here at americantrucks.com.